But Phil, I love I love both models. I mean, they're 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 quite different, but they feel they feel wonderful. This is this is the uh, Virginia Symphony model, and what I love about this is it has a kind of flexibility in the shape. You know, it has a place where you can put your middle finger, and your thumb fits so perfectly here. And then the length of the handle is just right for not gripping. You know, not not being tense, not holding it too tight, because it simply is is like cupped in your hand and it's perfect it, it the result is like the tom is weightless you know but you have a you have a you know you have a, a way of holding it that you're never you're never afraid it's going to fly out of your hand but there's no heaviness to it and there's no imbalance i mean i it seems to me like a perfect extension of my arm it's not flapping up and down it's a perfect extension which is very helpful to me and and then the original buffalo model which i cherish and i, I guess i've used this most of all is just a perfect baton. I mean, it's like the classic baton. It fits in your hand, just in the right place. It doesn't move, but it doesn't. It doesn't make you exert any kind of, of tension on your hand, and it's perfectly comfortable. Again, it's it just becomes your arm, and that's that's the best thing about a baton. It becomes your arm, so you can do everything you can do with your arm with this beautiful baton without any stress. And this is my little present, which I love. This is the the uh, the uh, copy of Mahler's original baton. Now it doesn't look like the others, and and the others will probably still be more comfortable. But still, to have a baton exactly like Mahler's baton means a lot. So Mahler four will definitely be using this. So Phil, thank you. You're the best. Oh, you're the welcome. Batons are incredible. Oh, thank you.